Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a hot minute since since I was on it last. So I was about that. I've been working. I know why I keep doing this because it's very irritating. But um, yeah, it's us. Okay, so in today's video, if you haven't seen by the title, it is going to be a favourites video, and I can't remember when I did the last one. So I'm not great at keeping up to date my own channel <laughs> so yes it's just going to be a favorites video so let's crack on with this and if you think my makeup is like bleh it's been on all day so yeah it's been on since okay what time did i get up and do it 9 10 11 12 been on like nearly 12 hours so yeah and yes I am in my pajamas because I'm just not asked putting a top on for a video I'm in my pajamas just deal with it okay it's like night time I'm tired well I'm comfy and I wanted to show you this so you gotta deal with it. okay so first up I am going to show you is kind of like I'm gonna do like skincare and then into makeup because I think that's the best way of doing it. Okay, the first thing is is a cleanser. It's from Shiseido and Shiseido is a Japanese brand. Um, it's known worldwide. If you don't know about it, look it up. It's insane. But the thing I love about Shiseido is their cleansing oil. Now this, now I have tried cleansers. I've tried Garnier, Marcella brilliant for like just taking off my like just kind of like barely there makeup but the cleanser this one is insane like you, okay I might insert a video if I can't if I remember to film while taking my makeup off I'll insert it if I don't I'm sorry but all you do need is two pumps so it's an oil so two pumps and just literally go like this and go like this it's insane like your makeup comes off like that like I've never used anything as good as this it's it's just insane okay I'm just just I'm leaving it there it's insane go check it out it's insane okay so after I cleanse I will then do my second cleanse which is like a deep cleanse so the cleanser I use now okay it's a little bit of a story of this um I used to first of all the cleanser is acne out and it's just the little bar soap and it's like this so like this comes in a pocket like this you can get it in a pocket with these three okay but it's a bit of a story because i stopped using acne out because i wanted to try something else because i just like you know i was getting something free so i decided to to try it so i did and i thought it was working and then i was getting really bad ones here you can kind of still see them if you are close enough or if I'm close enough to the camera look here you can still see it so I was kind of like getting annoyed at it and they were kind of like pustules so it means there was yellow and pus in it so I was really annoyed so one night I just went feck it I'm gonna go back to my acne out and see what happens so all I had was this and a small bar of this I used it woke up the next morning and my spots were minimized like so much they were so small like they weren't as sore it was just these products are just insane and know why I stopped. I'm so silly, I'm so blonde, I'm so stupid. I shouldn't have stopped when I have a really good product. And you know, don't stop it if you like it. Just because you're getting something free, don't stop it. But I honest to God rave. These products are insane. I even have pictures on my Instagram if you scroll down. My Instagram like a few months ago, it's a before and after. Or before and like using during my Hang on, my second thought my eyelashes coming off. Oh, during the acne out treatment, and it's insane. It just cleared my skin completely. Like I've never felt so good about my skin when I used that. And I don't know why I stopped because I'm a silly Billy. But anyway, you cleanse. I cleanse with this, and then it's kind of like a. It's not a toner. It's not. It's not a toner. It's like a glycolic kind of treatment. Oh, I wouldn't. Okay. and then this is like your cream your hydrating cream so for you when it dries out this is great so yeah 
brilliant. So moving away from skincare, that's kind of all my skincare that I use, is next is the makeup. Boop, 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 boop. So first up I am going to show you this, which is the P. Louise Rumor Base. So this is basically an eyeshadow base, but you can use it as, it's basically a concealer, but you can use it as an eyeshadow base, um, under eye concealer. Anything basically, you can use it to cover your eyebrows, anything. It's it's insane, the pigmentation is insane, it's just, it's really good. I bought, it was three for like, I want to say £20, I'm not sure, it was the, there was a deal, there's a deal you can get on the site, it's like three for £30, I, I, okay, I'm not great with maths. Alright, okay, yeah. Then we have an eyelash, random. Next is NYX and I don't know if I posted a picture of this or no it was an Instagram story. If you follow me on Instagram you would have seen that I went to Dublin and I had a Sesedo event and I went there or training should I say and then I went to Dublin into Dublin town so I shot a bit just a little just a little bit and I bought the NYX Vivid Brights. So these are just eyeliners, but just extremely bright eyeliners. So the yellow, purple, and blue. And I have, if you just can't, yeah, I have the purple on today, okay? Yeah. It's, and they're really easy to use. Like, um, I thought they were gonna be a bit, you know, oh, tedious, but they're actually really easy to use. So I'm really happy about that. So that's why they were my favorites. Duh. Keeping in the, theme of eyeliners is Inklosh gel liners, yeah? These, can you not? So, hang on, I'll turn them upside down. They can be the different colours. So, we have black, cream, and white. You're wondering why I have three of the Inklosh eyeliners. One, the black is insane. It doesn't budge, it doesn't smudge. It's just the best eyeliner right there even it's probably voted I can't remember I remember voting for it in one of the awards it's just insane the stay power the, uh, the staying power is insane and then 68 and 76 60 these I love for carving out like a cut crease these are insane so what I do is I'll use the jaw line first because it kind of cleans it up kind of gets rid of the shadow and then I'll use these babies which is insane. Didn't use this today, but you can use these for this kind of look. If you don't have purple, you could put these down and then put purple eyeshadow on top. Voila! Or pink. It's meant to be pink and I didn't have pink, so I went with purple. Then I have, kind of staying on eyes, I have the best palette that I have used. Like, I have never gotten the amount of looks that I have with this out of, does that make sense? Did that make sense? I did. Out of any other palette I have ever bought. It's it's insane. Like I just, it's, this palette is insane. If you're going to buy a palette, like buy this. Because it's just, you have all these colours, you know, and don't be scared of them. Like, don't, just don't be scared of them, okay? So, like, ugh. okay, so today I have on... So in the crease colour I have liquor and then blend it out with funky and then on the lid is wasted and it's just insane and like if you go through my Instagram, I'm really plug on my Instagram today, you'll see it like I'll, I'll probably tag Stacey Marie or I'll just say that I've used it like it's, it's such, such a versatile palette it's just, oh, it's just insane Stacey did a really good job on this insane. For contour I really, because I'm so fair, I love, or not love, I have no, I had no like contour colour from me, like I'm really pale so I had no, all they were warm, they were really warm and it was really making my skin look really weird, it was just too weird, it, I understand, I know it's weird. I went to Jervis Street and I asked about a contour shade and they were like, they suggested this one so it's the Inklosh Freedom System 515 and it is insane it's like this cool tone it's just like a nice shadow color it's just lovely love it love it 
and it's very pigmented it's like one little dip and you're like whoa you got contoured okay so moving on to lips it is the fleet cosmetics by easy lock so basically charlotte crosby i think her name is probably butchered her name sorry is she collabed or she made i can't remember her own little thing with easy locks and they came out with like lipsticks and she came out with what else she come out with eyelashes and a palette so i got a lipstick so this is daydream yeah daydream and it's like this now i'm wearing it now it's a very cool tone color i'd say but on the if you're ever in a store that has easy locks or fleet cosmetics and you see the the pictures on the band at the back of the display this looks really purple like i mean the vivid purple that you saw this it looks like this nope it's not it's not that color i have no idea what they were thinking in the photo shoot i think they had a fluorescent light on her and they were like bing i don't know i don't know it's just not that color okay just don't go by the colors on the the back of the why can't I talk on the back of the display don't go by them I'd actually swatch them that's what I did I swatched them and I found this and I thought do you know what I'll go with this one so I did I love it it's actually a really good colour and then staying on the lips is a kind of like volumizing lip booster lipstick kind of thing like kind of just a mm, kind of I remember doing this now. I had my my braces on, but I like a couple of weeks. And uh, sorry, my lipstick is just like ooh. I had my lipsticks. Oh my lipsticks! Ah, I had my braces on a couple of weeks, and I remember gotten like really bad blisters, like in behind this bottom lip here. So I made my lips look. I'm trying to do it now. It's like I had already a pouty lip, and it looked like I had gotten lip fillers. And then they made in work. They didn't make me, but they were like, oh, Louise, try the lip filler on. My lips literally looked like I went down the road and got lip fillers. I was like, no, girl, I didn't. That's just blisters and a lip blubber. But anyway, long story short, the blisters through the blisters? Yes, the blisters vanished, thank God. And then I still used the Catrice volumizing lip booster and it actually does plimp but there's like a little bit of a tingle and then it'll kind of oh. actually I want to see if it'll do it now I <laughs> just putting it on over this mm. so it's just like a cooling effect Mm. Call me. <laughs> I know. So it's just like a cooling, menthol kind of, kind of vibe. I love it. I've actually never put it on top of this lipstick, and I'm loving it. Loving it. Okay. Stop rambling. Get back to the actual video, Louise. Okay, for foundation, I have to say this is the best foundation I have been using for the past few weeks. I'm in love with it. I just... Best... The full... The most coverage I've ever gotten with a foundation. Now, okay. Marc Jacobs. Insane. Right? Coverage. But the price is insane as well. This coverage with this foundation is insane. And the foundation I'm on about is the Isadora Cover Up Foundation and Concealer. Now, it's insane. Like, I have... It's just... Like, I've gotten compliments. Like, going, oh my god, what have you worn? I'm just like, oh, it's Isadora. Like, you know what I mean? And I think it's like 15 euro. I'm not... Um, don't quote me on that. I should know the price. I sell it. Jesus. But it's... It's not... It's not... It's affordable. Do you know what I mean? And it's a big size tube. So it's a 30ml, I think. Oh, yeah, actually, it's a 35ml. 
So I'm pretty sure it's like a smidgen more than normal foundations. And it's an actual clump. So I thought when um, I saw first when it came, I was like, oh my god, it's a you're gonna have to squeeze the foundation out and I can't stand that when foundations are like that. But no, it's a pump and it's the coverage is insane. Just insane. And the best way I have been applying it is it's a bit dirty because I, I used it today, okay? So don't don't judge my dirty brush, okay? It is the Inca 4SS brush. And you're probably like, Louise, it's tiny. It's it's insane. The reason this is meant to be an eyeshadow brush. I went into the girls and I was asking the 4SS brush, what is it? It's meant to be an eye brush. How? Well, you could really, you could put, like, just, whoa, like, it's insanely big for my eyelids. But it's insane for foundation. I'm getting in the nice. In the neck. I've, that's a lovely view. I just gave you some of my teeth. Did you like it? Thanks. Uh, yeah, it's insane brush, a lovely brush, so good for us, just, just getting, I'm going to actually get another few of these, because they're really handy to have, and they'll be great for contour and concealer, it's very good for concealer for like tapping. Okay, next few bits, I'm just going to, they're just random, so I'm just going to throw them in there. It is perfumes, okay, I love perfumes, I love, I just, I'm so weird, but like, I'm, if I like you know, as a person who smells nice, I'm like, oh my god, they smell really nice. I really want to know what they're wearing. I don't ask them. I'm not that weird. I've done it once or twice, okay? I've just done it once or twice. Not a lot. That's not a lot. Okay. Okay, but the two that I've been loving this so far are Molecules 1, Molecules 01 or something. Molecules. Yeah, Molecule 01. It's just something about it. It was actually my mom that got it first and I was in, just in love with the smell. I just pretended I'm like, oh my god, mom, I fell on your perfume. Sorry. I went and bought it. It's actually in Misha for 55 euro, which I think is cheaper than Harvey Nichols. I'm not sure. Check it out. Oh my god, stop doing that. I'm going to sound like I have an issue. Issues. And the second one is one from MAC and it is Candy Yum Yum. It's much sweeter than Molecules. I just love it. I freaking love it. It's just so pretty. It's just... I remember smelling it in MAC and leaving the place, kicking myself that I didn't get it and I went back up the last time. I was in Dublin and I bought it. Cause Freaking insane. I love it. Go buy it and tell them that I got it, told you to get it. Just the last thing is random, but I recommend anyone that has braces, teeth, everyone has teeth, just, just buy these. These are the TP Plaque Search Disclosing Tablets. Track your plaque for better brushing. These are insane. These turn your mouth blue. They look like e tablets. They're not, but they turn your mouth. Blue, pure blue, like I mean that freaking purple blue. See that on the brush? That, that is your mouth. And yeah, insane. Just insane. And then, first of all, you brush your teeth as normal, and then you rinse around these after you've brushed, and you can see where you've missed the plaque. So, red is new plaque, and blue is old plaque. Insane. Brilliant for people with braces, i.e., me. Insane. So yes, that was my favourite video. I hope you enjoyed it. It was really quick and really relaxed. Well, kind of relaxed, really rushed. I don't care. I just wanted to tell you my favourite things because I'm excited and weird. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, I shall see you in my next one, and hopefully it'll be shorter. And this, I thought I said half an hour. And I was like, I have not been talking for a half an hour thumbs up this video and uh, if you're not a subscriber, subscribe. Bye!